Hello YouTube, uh, Geep here. Just uh, wanting to make a quick video uh, about the Wormwood modular gaming table. Um, just to give my a few thoughts on it. Uh, as when I was shopping for mine, uh, could not find the information I was looking for. Um, although I did find a ton of information on Discord. Um, just wanted to show a few things, give my initial thoughts. Um, I did order the uh, 96 inch by 56 inch, which is the large and wide, depending on which Kickstarter page you look at. Um, I did do a website order after the 2.0 Kickstarter, so it would have been between 2.0 and 3.0, uh, and I chose Rustic Walnut, um, uh, basically because I think it's gorgeous. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, uh, initial impressions are, we love the way it looks. Um, it is super sturdy on the rails. Uh, the rustic walnut has a ton of character. If you do not like character, definitely do not get the rustic walnut. You'd probably want to go with black walnut if you like the walnut family. Um, the uh, plain surface, I did opt for the neoprene, uh, plain surface versus the felt. I went with the black. It's double-sided. It's ash on the back. This is the tuckable neoprene mat, which I do not believe that uh, Wormwood uh, carries anymore. I believe you have to get a felt one, and then it doesn't tuck anymore. Um, and then I have the Hobby Vault over on the end, and we purchased multiple accessories. Um, so thoughts? Um, yeah. Yeah. Basically, if you're getting one, get the accessories, <laughs> the cup holders, the hobby shelves, or whatever they choose to call them now, organizational shelves. These silicone bins that they sell, incredible quality. Um, they are no joke. Uh, the card holders are great. Um, the hobby vault, which I have a, just a bunch of stuff in right now. Hard to open with one hand, uh, but you can see... Maybe if I zoom out here, uh, lots of storage in there. I've got my cup holders, some end caps, and then a ton of silicone trays. I find these coasters are really fun for little bits and stuff too. Got the shallow silicone trays, um, magnetic pins for the tablecloths. Um, and this, this is just really nice having a shelf at the end of the game table. Again, I know that this is a... Uh, larger table so you'd be giving up a, a lot of space to be able to do that in the uh, medium or the smalls uh, but on mine you can see we won't be having problems with running out of room anymore the uh, some thoughts I had I think I had mentioned in the beginning I had an origins game table for about two years um, great table game theory makes great table great surface um, we just never fell in love with the rails. Uh, the bins on the rails got in the way of actually leaning into the game. Um, I think they're too wide versus these rails. Uh, you get right into the game plane. We primarily play um, some larger 4X games. We do not war game. We do not play D&D. &D. Just tired of running out of room to put things. And I believe this solves it. Uh, the last thing I think I would bring up would be uh, a lot of concern over the stability of the table in the center, given that it is, uh, so wide and the table does not come standard with braces. Uh, you have to add that on, uh, as an accessory. Full disclosure, uh, in the third Kickstarter, I bought the, the support brackets from what I researched online did not like the fact that the middle of the table was going to be not as sturdy as what I would like. Um, I will try to show it here. I can assure you the table's solid. Um, but being a larger guy myself, my brother who I play with a lot is a larger guy. Uh, we like to lean in on things. <laughs> 
in my opinion, if you are going to lean on that table and put two hands in and lean in, you're going to want the support braces. Uh, not because I think the table's going to bust, just because of the stability issue of putting your hands in that vault and then having it move. Um, and I'm not talking about 300 pounds here either. I'm talking like, you know, just <laughs> the normal weight of a person. Uh, again, that's my opinion. I will be doing a follow-up video once I get my braces. Uh, I did get a shipping notification for those just last night. So really good timing there. Um, yeah, any questions about the table itself? Uh, love to help you answer those questions. Uh, leave me a comment. I'll get back to you. Like I said, I, uh, not a lot, not a lot out there as far as reviews of the table, other than the lot of medium, uh, with tables, but not the wide. So yeah, I hope you have a great night. And like I said, I will do a follow-up video when I get those braces put in and, uh, yeah, have a great night.